Our community, the LGBT community, uh, well understands the need for immigration. In 75 countries around this globe, our existence is criminalized. In 10 of those countries, our existence can be met uh, with the death penalty. We often have to seek uh, asylum relief uh, at this nation in the United States. Uh, we understand what it is to live through the trauma that would force you to leave your home country and show up here seeking assistance. And so we understand how horrible it would be to show up in this country and to be put into a cage with the most minimal concerns for well-being and quality of life. Our caucus stands outraged by what is happening in this country. And we encourage all Californians to not get distracted by yesterday's deceptive executive order that may suggest that all has gone back to being normal when far, it is far from the truth. We ask everyone to join us and the members of the Latino Caucus and every caucus that's represented here to take to the streets this Saturday, as I will be doing in San Diego, with thousands of my constituents to make sure that when the history of this time is written, it will be clear that California stood in opposition to this heinous act being perpetrated against children. Thank you to the Latino Caucus and its leaders uh, for organizing this, this morning's uh, gathering. Thank you to the free press, who is protected by the First Amendment still, I believe, uh, for being here to help publicize this. The, the LGBT Legislative Caucus stands in solidarity with the other folks here today to say that this is wrong and we will fight it until it is stopped.